Hey everyone, John and Renan are here again, and today we're going to show you our new project, which is to rebuild and restore Renan's first balance bike, which is a Strider bike. Say hi. Hi. What's your name? Renan. Renan. Renan's got his tools out too. So, the scope of our project is to take this old bike, which is really beat up. He got it when he was 18 months old and uh, he's been in love with it since and then we've upgraded a couple of uh, times since then because this bike is just really worn out. Um, yeah. We'll give you a closer look. bike out didn't you? Yeah I crashed it. You crashed it a lot too. Yeah. So what we're gonna do is we're going to make it a full custom bike so we're gonna take it to our powder coater as you see we're in our race shop so we have access to powder coaters and uh, you know some really talented people in the industry that can help us with some custom things so first step yeah, is to... Yeah and I what? did a big crash. You did a big crash? Yeah. Is that how you got all these marks? Yeah. Yeah. So we're going to strip the bike down and bring it to powder coaters tomorrow and we're going to do a, a custom color for sure and uh, rebuild it from parts that we source from the uh, Wild Child Bikes, uh, wildchildbikes.com and uh, they do custom strider, they do custom strider parts and uh, some really cool things to help you rebuild, customize and uh, make it yours. So our goal is to strip and new paint. We're definitely going to put pneumatic air tires on it. Um, we have some really trick handlebars coming, some carbon fiber handlebars. Uh, and uh, definitely redo the grips. The grips are totally shot. Um, and kind of do a frame off restoration on it. And we're going to really see where we can take it and um, hopefully use it for BMX racing and also we plan to do the Strider Cup races so we want a nice custom bike to go to those with and I want to go motor track you want to go to the motor? yeah the motor track that's what Renan calls the BMX track yeah. so this was a pretty good BMX bike actually except for these foam tires um, Striders are you know, probably the brand name that you think of when you see a balance bike um, most people just call them Strider bikes whether they're a Strider bike or not so that's that's pretty good and the bike is, is a good bike it's really light um, you know it has a good frame good standover uh, adjustable seat you, know, you can put it way down adjustable handlebars you can put those way up so um, you know it's a good bike overall but on the BMX track the foam tire is really limited because it gets you know really bouncy and it starts jumping around over the small bumps and imperfections in the track which isn't good for racing. So we upgraded to a different bike for BMX racing with air tires and he did a lot better with it. So I feel with the Strider frame, the ability to stand on the footrest here with air tires and some more front frontward facing handlebars to make him lean forward Daddy. a bit. Yeah, what do you want to say? I want to give this bike something cool. You want to do something cool? Yeah. We are going to do something cool to it. Alright, you want to start tearing it apart? Yeah. Yeah, alright, let's start tearing it apart. So, this is pretty easy, right? Yeah. So we unclip this seat, pull the seat out. I don't out. want to do it. Can you pull the seat out? I want to stand on it. Well, no, you can't stand on it. Pull the seat out. We're taking it apart. Almost. Yep. There it is. There it is. Okay, there's the seat. Yep. There's the seat clamp. Yeah. The next thing to do is the handlebars. Okay. What do we do here? Just pull these out? Yep. Try it. Almost, almost. There you go. There you go. We have the rolling frame, which just forks just popped out really easy. The handlebar clamp. Okay. And looks like the only thing we have left is to Disconnect the wheels, which is a 14 millimeter ratchet. Yeah. Right? Yeah. 
right? And you work on that back one. Those come apart. Let's see. You gotta do it. No! But push I it. Have... Here, push it. Almost. Mm -hmm. There you go. Now let's do this one. That one's already loose. Look. Pull the wheel off. Pull the wheel off. Oh, we gotta get that nut on the other side off? Nope. Yeah, and the little... All right, pull it off. Hey, look. Oh. That was easy, wasn't it? Yeah. That took like 30 seconds. That's the fastest bike we've ever taken apart, isn't it? Yeah, when we hold it. Whoa, it's pretty light, isn't it? Mm. Yeah? It's really big. It's really big? Yeah. Yeah? What color do you want to make it? Green. Green? Yeah. Maybe. It'd be white or green. White or green? Yeah. Yeah? White and green. So we have two tires. It'd be really playful. We're getting new wheels and tires, so we don't need to save any of this. They're really beat up. That's it. All of our parts are all right here. All we have to do is buy new ones now, right? That's it. So the next video will be us getting it back from powder coating and then sourcing our parts through Wild Child Bikes, right? Okay, say bye until next time. Bye.